Southeast Asian leaders said they had agreed on a plan with Myanmar's junta chief on Saturday to end the crisis there, but added that he did not explicitly respond to demands to halt the killing of civilian protesters. Myanmar's senior general attended the leaders' meeting of the Association of Southeast Asian Nations, or ASEAN. Malaysia's Prime Minister, Muhyiddin Yassin, spoke to reporters shortly after. In his statement, he said he will find a way to solve the problem. We tried not to accuse his side too much because we don't care who's causing it. We just stress that the violence must stop, but he agreed that violence must stop. For him, it's the other side that's causing the problems. If that's the case, we hope that he will find a way to stop it even before the ASEAN representatives go to Myanmar. ASEAN leaders wanted a commitment from the general to restrain his security forces. An activist monitoring group says they have killed at least 745 people since a mass civil disobedience movement erupted to challenge his February 1st coup. According to a statement from the ASEAN chair Brunei, a consensus was reached on ending violence and having a constructive dialogue among all parties facilitated by a special ASEAN envoy. But there was no mention of releasing political prisoners in the statement. Myanmar is part of the 10-nation ASEAN, which has a policy of consensus decision-making and non-interference in the affairs of its members. The ASEAN gathering was the first coordinated international effort to ease the crisis in Myanmar since the coup began.